Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video. So, in this video, I will be showing you guys my little stunt minis warehouse. It's uh, it's small, but I got, I got some stuff down here. I got some stuff. So we're going to start in the left corner. I have, uh, these are like Tau Tau and SSR. These are frames. I got forks, some swing arms. Those cases or organizers, those are all OEM Honda 50 internals and stuff for the motor. Moving along, I got a black wheel set, some tires and wheels and stuff like that for the Honda 50s. That rim that you see right there. Yeah, there it is. That setup is for my 70. Um, she's sitting in a very uncomfortable position because she needs rear spokes or a rear wheel. I'm missing spokes, but it's insanely expensive to buy individual spokes. It's like four or five dollars for each spoke and I need like 25 of them. So, um, if I come across a complete wheel for pretty cheap, I'll grab it. But if not, I'll, I'll just wait. It's not worth it for an OEM wheel. They want like two hundred and eighty-five dollars. I don't have the cash right now to spend. I'll wait for it on a parts bike or something. So these two bikes are going to be combined into one for my buddy Ryan. That's probably going to be his track bike. Um, these are OEM Honda frames. I am going to repaint this silver one, and all the BBR stuff is going back on it. The reason why I'm doing that is because this is the only. Excuse me. This is the only frame currently that I have paperwork for. My my wallet was stolen a while back and my registration to my other frame was in there. So it's just just to be safe, I don't want to have all of my expensive like BBR stuff on a frame that doesn't have paperwork. And then let's just say it does get impounded and they're like, nope, you can't get it back. That would suck. They, I mean, it would suck to get any 50 impounded, but with all of your goodies on it, no. Put that on the registered frame, the one with paperwork or insurance or whatever. So, in this corner, this is all literally just OEM Honda stuff. You know, uh, transmission, starter shafts, I have brake shoes and stuff down there. Um, cases, got cylinder heads, complete, incomplete, flywheel covers, plastic, still in the plastics, seats swingers forks you name it i pretty much had like four or five parts 50s come in the door that i personally bought because i i love honda 50s they're my favorite bike what else can you put around your town with and not make any noise besides a pit bike i mean i like honda 50 you know i like the honda 70 i like the crf 110s i like them all pit bike is that's just my thing i love pit bikes you could throw them in a trunk and you know, like I don't get me wrong, I love riding big bikes and everything, but if it came down to like something that I would like have to keep, it'd be like this, like a, a done up pit bike. Just because you could take it everywhere, parts are cheap, they're super reliable, they're bulletproof. Um me specifically, I'm not biased, I'm not biased, ride what you want. I am like I'm six two and I still prefer a Honda fifty. That's just me. I'll get a one ten, I'll build up the seventy. But everybody knows me. I'm a 50 guy. If there's actually, if there's any, um, if there's any, um, people from Stunt Minis, let me know in the comment section. I have a group on Facebook called Stunt Minis. It's literally, it's, it's in the title, Stunt Minis. It's just a bunch of guys, kids, adults, and we all ride minis, whether it's a Grom, a 110, a 90, we all ride minis. There's even some mini quad riders in there. They don't post much content, but they're, they're ridiculous. So, um. Yeah, if uh if there's any guys watching this video that aren't in the group that want to be in a group that's all mini specific, join uh Stunt Minis on Facebook. There's like four questions and then you got to agree to rules and then bam, you get accepted. And uh great group of guys. They're they're amazing. They're cool. They they answer your questions when you post. They'll answer your questions. They'll like your pictures. Like they they're real people, you know. I'm trying to build like a serious community. Like Besides the bikes, I want I want a serious a seriously real community of good people. I'm tired of groups full of assholes and everybody that's just super biased and opinionated. Like, go somewhere with that. We're gonna have a group of mini riders. We're gonna host some meetups. We're gonna do giveaways. We're gonna have fun and we're gonna keep it minis. We're gonna keep it minis, you know. But um, 
yeah, I guess I'm gonna end it here. I just I I didn't really have any content for Monday. Besides today, we were out on like the big bikes, and it's just it was just so much stupid shenanigans. Like it wasn't even worth it to make a video out of. Um, so I figured I'd come down here, show you guys what's going on down here. Definitely gonna get some more stuff down here. I might wind up getting like a little tool set up down here just to like, you know, work on like future projects and stuff like that and not overcrowd the the shop and all of that because it's it's annoying trying to do like personal things inside the shop and then people come by and they're like, what the hell is going on here? But um, yeah, so for those of you, if there's anyone new to the channel, that's just watching for the first time and you just, you seem a little interested, maybe click that subscribe button. If you guys are already people from the channel and just have some comments, let me know in the comment section. I'll get back to you guys. Definitely check out Stunt Minis on Facebook. I'm the admin of the group. Like I said, answer a few questions and then bada bing, bada boom, you're in. And um, yeah, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you guys got, if you guys got any collections, if you guys are hoarding parts. Let me know in the comment section. It's always it's always cool to meet someone else that's like, you know, this much of a fanatic about minis. There's uh there's actually fifty if you on YouTube, it's called Fifty Channel. He's he's the he's one that's definitely above me. His channel is all fifty. So go check his channel out. Drop in there, check out his videos. He's got some dope builds, some crazy ride outs. But um yeah, thanks again for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next one.